Hi, I'm Ryan McCaffrey with Official Xbox Magazine, and because we know you can't get enough, we're here in San Francisco today to see more of Call of Duty World at War. Today we're going to check out the co-op mode. Turns out there's two co-op modes, a campaign co-op and a competitive co-op. So let's go upstairs and check out and see what they're all about. Campaign mode allows you to play the game from start to finish, two to four players, basically play the storyline of the game with your buddy. And then there's competitive co-op, which is sort of like an arcade mode that keeps tally of scores, kill streaks, a number of times you actually hit enemies, and it's basically an arcade mode that tallies up at the end of the game. What's unique about both modes is they actually tied into multiplayer in terms of XP. So very much like in Call of Duty 4, where a lot of people grinded for XP, you can actually do this in co-op as well. So if you're a little hesitant to go into multiplayer right away and want to rank up, you can actually earn XP in co-op mode, earn you know, sufficient XP to then transfer over to multiplayer, get to sort of create a class, unlock those classes, have more weapons, more sort of uh, types of classes that you can then use within multiplayer. It's World War II, so there's weapons you're kind of familiar with but you haven't seen in a little while. The PPSH, great submachine gun, rate of fire is awesome. It's one of those things when you actually pick it up and find that level and you've got it, you're like, wow, where has this been you know, all my life? Great weapon. Flamethrower as well, just the technology behind it. You know, you've seen flames in other games before. This is the first one where you actually are shooting this weapon and it just feels so powerful and so awesome. And not only are you actually getting rid of, you know, destroying your enemies around you, but everything within the environment is just kind of lighting on fire, the particle effects, cinders on everything, and it's either, you know, if it's combustible, like, you know, some grass or anything like that, it's just, you're like, wow, this is like a very all-powerful weapon. A lot of new things that are going to be familiar, but a lot of new things you're going to be like, wow, this is cool, you know, that is sort of new and different to what Call of Duty 4 multiplayer had. Well, the game's looking great, and trust me, it's playing great too. For more on Call of Duty World at War, check out official Xbox magazine in print and at oxmonline.com.